What's good, everybody? What's good, everybody? Good afternoon, everybody. Good afternoon, and welcome to the Maurice Delk channel. I want to introduce y'all <laughs> someone right here. And it's the truth, y'all. This man have been the best president since Abraham Lincoln. I want to introduce our president, Donald J. Trump, the king of the black people. That's right. He's the king of the black people. You know, he is the, I'm, I'm serious. He's the closest you'll ever get to a black president because when we had Obama, we didn't get close at all. We actually took a step back and they promoted more segregation because he endorsed Joe Biden as vice president, the same president, I mean, the same vice president, the same person that signed that crime bill, helped lock black people up, helped throw away the key and lock Negroes up. So shout out to Trump, the king of the black people. See, when I first came in this movement, I was hearing that I was a sellout, that, man, you the only black Trump supporters. Man, ain't that many black Trump supporters. I'm going to tell you this right now. In the beginning, there were many Trump, black Trump supporters. But guess what? In this, Right here in 2020, there are way more black Trump supporters than there was in 2016 because people are waking up. People are tired. I know pro-blacks that said that they're going to vote for Trump. My best friend. I'll tell you, my best friend I grew up with, he didn't even like Trump and he's voting for him. I'm just showing, I'm just throwing it out here. But shout out to Donald J. Trump, the king of the black people. We got blacks for Trump over here. I love this because this is a movement and we are black voices for Trump. And we that voice that's against the globalists. We that voice against the plantation. That's what we call black voices for Trump. I'm that black voice for Trump. And <laughs> don't get it twisted. Mostly all the black Trump supporters that I have met, <laughs> they are hood. They don't play. They ain't the one to be after with. You dig what I'm saying? I'm just saying. So we are. we got a lot of people, a lot of us out here like this. So this is what they call you know, Nazis right here. Come on now, do they look like Nazis over here? We got to show people what we made of. And we got to show people what they are made of. You dig what I'm saying? I'm just getting warmed up right here, y'all. I'm that black voice for Trump. We are black voices for Trump and we are stronger than Black Lives Matter because Black Lives Matter don't hardly have black people in it, in a, in a, in a, in a, in a movement. In that group, black voice for Trump, Trump, we are the black voices for Trump. We are the voices for Trump. See, we're not segregated. It's to show people that we are the one, that we are the great awakening. Because 98% of black voice for Trump voted for Obama before. I'm serious. I say 99%. Voted for Obama before, and I ain't ashamed to say it, I voted for Obama on the first term. The second one, I didn't vote. But we have to, we have to go ahead and take our country black. Black voices for Trump is the voice that is helping keeping America great. We are fighters, and we are USA citizens. We're not Africans. We are Americans. We are ebony. I say ebony American because I love my beautiful black people, man. I love. I, I believe my black people are beautiful. I don't know why they call us self, self hate Negroes because black is beautiful. I believe black is beautiful. I believe black is. I, I'm just saying, even though I like being light skinned, I mean we beautiful too, though. But <laughs> I get the twisted. But uh, black voices for Trump, Trump 2020, man. I'm encourage every black person out there. What the hell you got to lose? Look, look what's going on, man. Look at Biden. He don't even want to campaign 
right now. He making y'all look like idiots. He's not putting in the work. Why would you vote for someone that ain't putting in the work? The only work that he had put in is to keep my culture, your culture, black people, to keep your culture incarcerated. Incarcerated. I think incarcerated. But you know what I mean? I'm just saying, y'all. We are that voice. We are the great awakening. We woke. We woke. And we expose socialism. We expose uh, the plantation. We expose for real. And black voices for Trump, we are the one that will free the slaves. We are the one. We, we this ain't no underground railroad. We are over. I'm, I'm just saying this is we're not we're not underground. We 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 are out here. This ain't no underground railroad over here. I'm sorry, but Harriet Tubman ain't got nothing on Black Wall Street for Trump right now. Now, 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 now. This is this this is what you call the Great Awakening. Can I get a witness over here? Can I get a witness? Could anybody listen to me? Because we are that voice. We are that chosen one. You feel me? Look at us. Look at us. We are woke. Text woke to 88022. Text, text woke. We are woke. We are woke. That, I mean, this is a moon. We are a, we are the great awakening. We are woke. We 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 we're so woke that we don't even. But don't, don't get it twisted. We so woke that we will sleep with one eye open watching y'all. Hmm. We always woke. We always woke. We always will hear your footsteps. We always see you coming. We 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 always see it. And shout out to my beautiful black people that voted for Trump. Shout out to my beautiful black people that are voting for Trump, that are going to vote for Trump. Shout out to my beautiful black people. Shout out to the Ebony Americans, you know. And once again, shout out to the king of the black people, Donald J. Trump. Donald J. Trump, the king of the black people. Look at this. We are the black voices for Trump. I'm telling you, we're not sleepwalking. We are walking while they are stalking. I'm telling you. We are that voice against evil. We're that voice against Hollywood. We're that voice. Black voices for Trump. You see my guy, Mari Samo, shout out to you. You know, look at us, man. These are these are my beautiful black people right here. I ain't see. Sorry, pro-blacks. Y'all played out. Y'all history, pro-black. Sorry. Y'all history pro black. This is the great awakening. This is a new anointing right here. Black voices for Trump. I am a black voice for Trump. You want to be a black voice for Trump? Go ahead and speak out on it. Go ahead and go. Go ahead and vote red. Go ahead and vote them out. If you want to be, a, I'm look, look, look at me. I'm campaigning for. <laughs> for our president. I'm campaigning for black voices for Trump. You know why I'm campaigning? Because I can. Oh, not only is I can, because I care about this country. I don't want to go to no Africa. I mean, don't let them don't let them white liberals label you. They're the most racist people. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. You think I'm lying? They are the most racist people. Racist people have no clue. They have a hidden agenda that they want to destroy our country. <laughs> they don't like us. They don't like you. You know, just look at us, man. Look at this. Look at the beautiful black people right here. Look at beautiful black people. They said we own. Ain't no, ain't no black. Ain't no black people that support Trump. Any black people that, that any black person that support Trump, you are a coon. You are you sold out. You are a traitor to your own race. No, 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 no. If you vote for if you black and you vote for Biden, you are a chump and you are a traitor to your own race, to your own culture. We're not traitors. We 
want to save the black community. We want to help the black community. That's what we about. We about that life. We about that life. We about it, about it, and ride around it. You dig what I'm saying? We're a black voice for Trump, and I'm, and I'm a proud to say it. I'm a black voice for Trump. Trump 2020. Election is coming right around the corner. Who will you vote for? Will you vote for that racist Biden? Or you would you vote for, you know, the king of the black people, Donald J. Trump? You dig what I'm saying? Got to recognize. Got to recognize. Look at this. Yeah, I'm, a little, I'm, I'm not going to be PC. Negroes for Trump. Yes, I said it. <laughs> That's what we are. Look at us, man. You know? And we proud of it. We proud of it. The only thing you can do is throw the coon card. The most popular word. The coon, the coon, the coon. Look at this. We are. You know what? We are the coons, though. We are coon. Conservative, organized, outgoing, Negro. Can I repeat that again? Conservative, organized, outgoing Negro. Because I am a conservative and I am organized and I'm very outgoing. Everybody love me. People love me. And I'm a Negro. <laughs> you dig what I'm saying? Come on now. Come on. This is G status for us, man. This is G status for us. G status for us. We gangster. We gangster. We want them dollars. Where them dollars at? Nigga, where them dollars at? We gangster over here. We gangster over here. You know, we want we, we do want to get paid. We do want to get paid. We don't want y'all to, we don't want the sorry uh uh, uh 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 white liberals, white democrats. We don't want y'all paying us because y'all only wanna y'all wanna keep us in debt. Y'all wanna keep us stuck. Y'all want to keep us with this free shit. Y'all ain't paying us, man. We want we want to pay ourselves. We want small bit. We want to show people that blacks can keep America great. We can do this. We're going to wipe out Black Lives Matter. We're going to wipe out BLM. Black voices for Trump. That's who we are. That's who we are. That's who we are. You know, for real, man. The real celebrity status right here. You know what I'm saying? Screw Hollywood. We, we the real celebrities over here. You dig what I'm saying? <laughs> Shout out to the king of the black people, Donald J. Trump. Better hop on the Donald J. Trump train. Get off that plantation. Gotta get off that plantation. I'm just saying, man. Look at us, man. We G'd up, man. Shout out to Deontay Harris, my dude on the left side. You know? Look at this, man. Look, look, look at this. I know people going to say, oh, they're brainwashing little kids. What the, what's the difference? Y'all be having little kids with Black Lives BLM stuff on? Huh? You be seeing little white kids with BLM on? You see all this, man. What's the matter with kids walking around with uh, Black Voices for Trump? Trump 2020. That's right. Train the child the way they should go. And they will not go astray. You dig what I'm saying? Y'all better recognize the truth. Y'all better recognize the proof because the truth will set you free. And also the proof will set you free because this is, I always give y'all the proof. I always do that to y'all, man. But y'all don't listen. Y'all think I'm being a jive turkey. You dig what I'm saying? Y'all think I'm being a, a jive sucker. And I ain't being a jive sucker, man. You dig what I'm saying? Let me let me, let me, let me go back to this picture right here. Oh, oh, look at my throwback right here, man. Look at this, look at this man. See, I had to show my look, look, look. I had to go show off my face right here, man. Look at it, man. You know what I'm saying? A couple of years back, you know what I'm saying? You see Uber Guy on the left, me right here, right next to Uber Guy. And you see my sister, Hope Coleman, right here. And you see Will Johnson from United America First. He's in Austin, Texas. Shout out to you. We right here. We doing it, man. We 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 all doing it. We've been putting in the work. This is this is old picture. I had to throw that up on here. You know what I'm saying? This is an old picture right there, man. But we got this, y'all. We got this. This is our time to shine. This is our time to shine. Please believe it, y'all. Please believe it. Our president has done a hell of a job. Your president has done a hell of a job. And we have to be thankful for that. We have to be grateful for that. Seriously, yo. Seriously. 
We have to be grateful. We got to be grateful. We can't be ungrateful because we already live in, 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 in an ungrateful generation. This is why I had to spit this to you. This is why I had to bring this to you. Because we are that voice, Black Voice of Trump. Move over, BLM, because we are here. We are here. We are here. And ain't nobody stopping us. And ain't nobody topping us. Ain't nobody going to top us. I tell you the truth. I gave you the proof right here. Black Voice for Trump is rising up. We have risen. Black Voices for Trump, stand up. Stand up. Stand up with your hands up. And we ain't talking about hands up, don't shoot. We ain't talking about none of that. Stand up with your hands up. Stand up with your, with your head up. Keep your head up to the sky. Because the devil is a lie. The devil is a lie. The enemy is a liar. And the truth is not in him. Man. Y'all know I be on fire with this. Y'all know my desire with this. Y'all know I don't. Y'all know Maurice Delk don't play. Y'all know Maurice Delk spit fire. I'm, I'm, I'm just saying. BLM do not want to come across. They don't want to come my way. They don't want to come my way. And you don't want to come my way. You don't want to come our way. Because we are the man, we are the chosen one. Many are called, but few are chosen. Few are chosen. We're against the grain over here. We're against the grain. We're not wandering in the wilderness. We're not wandering. We're not waiting on a human being. We're not sitting up there trying to uh, worship a golden calf. I'm just saying. I love, I love, I love, I love black people. Don't get us twisted that we self-hating. Wouldn't trade being black for the world. It feels good to be black, damn it. Feels good to me. And hey, look, 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 I'm, I'm not just race baiting and White people be proud to be white too, man. We, but, 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 but black wasn't for Trump. We are important to go ahead and tear these Black Lives Matter down to go ahead and wake more black people up. So it's good for people like us to go ahead and do that, you know. And I, I, I want to wake everybody up. You can't save everybody. I have learned that you can't save everybody. You can't save everybody, but you can wake people up. You can plant a seed. Because we are the seed planters. And we will take that seed, have that seed, and grow it into a big tree. It might take some time, but we can grow it into a big tree. You dig what I'm saying? Man, whoo, we, man, this is just a breath of fresh air to see black people, black voices for Trump. It's it's a breath, a breath of fresh air. I'll tell you how this. So, whew, I think I said enough over here, y'all. Make sure y'all get out there and vote. And I'm going to encourage the voters out there that's going to vote. Conservatives, come on now. Black was for Trump. Everybody. White was for Trump. Asians was for, for Trump. Gays for Trump. I'm going to say it. Go, go out there and vote. If you can't vote on Election Day. Vote on election day. Take a stand. Let's get this landslide going right there. If you don't do that, we won't get that landslide. Do, do, do as I ask y'all to, y'all. And, and, and I'm, I'm telling you, obedience is better than sacrifice. I'm telling y'all, just go there to the polls and vote. Get there. Get your tail there. Get your tail there, man. I'm asking you. And I know a lot of y'all are undercover, but I'm asking you to get there. I'm asking you, all right? Oh, man, 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 I think I said enough. You know, I should stick around for a little bit, but I think I really said enough. I'm just, 
over all this BS. I'm over all of it. I'm over all the TDS, Trump, the range and the syndrome. I'm over it. I'm over people just getting triggered because they hear that they hear that name. I'm over it. I'm over. I'm over illiterate black people in the neighborhood. I'm, I'm, I'm saying it like this. You know, when I say illiterate, I know that a lot of y'all can read, but come on now, man. You, you, you're not paying attention. You're not paying attention. You just want attention. You want you 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 want to keep up with the Jones. You want to keep up with the uh, you know with the popular opinions. You want to be it's, it's very popular to hate Trump. And you, you know what? You forget the popularity. You are popular in your own self. You are somebody. You are somebody. You are more than a conqueror. You are more than a conqueror. You are you 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 are more than a, you are so much more than a conqueror that you will oh, come on now. Ain't no weapon that formed against you is going to prosper, and every time every tongue that rises against you shall be condemned. They will be condemned if, they, if every tongue that rises up against you shall be condemned. You can't let these people condemn you, because when they do that, they condemn themselves. So you got to rebuke them. You got to stay woke. Got to stay woke. I've seen people hop off, hop off. I've seen it. And we got to stick there and encourage one another. We got to encourage one another. We got to encourage each other. Because this is what we are up against. We are up against principalities. We're not up against flesh and blood. We are against principality. We are, we are against the darkness of this world. We are, we are against that. And God brings us a leader. God does. He, he, he brings not someone that we can follow blindly because we worship God, not government. And I'm just saying shout out to, again to our president, Donald J. Trump, the king of the black people, the king of the black people. Man, we got this, y'all. We got this. And we got to keep on fighting. We got to keep this going. If we don't keep this going, we all going to, I'm telling you, we're going to lose this damn country. We're going to lose our children. We're going to lose our grandchildren. We're going to lose our great-grandchildren because they're trying to abuse our great-grandchildren. Come on, can I get a witness over here? They are they are trying to abuse. They're already doing it to our grandchildren. They're already doing it to our children. Look what they're doing with the, uh, 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 you know, you know, with some pronouns. You know what I'm talking about. They're teaching fifth, kindergarten that there's 15 different genders. Come on now, y'all know what I'm talking about. They don't love us. They hate you. They hate me. We got to stay mindful. Not, I'm telling you, we got to we gotta stay spiritual minded while they're being plantation minded. I talked about this in 2016. I made videos called plantation minded. They are plantation minded because they don't have a mind of their own. They want to take other people's mind and be like them. You know, everybody want to be like my, yeah, I want to be like mine. You know, everybody want to go ahead and say, Jordan, Jordan. They want to be like, oh, oh, yeah, everybody. Come on now. We can't worship Hollywood. We can't worship government. We got to worship God. You feel what I'm saying? We got to worship God. Because he's the Alpha and Omega, the beginning and the end, the first and the last, the A to the Z. I'm just saying this. But we got to go ahead and uh, vote our President Donald J. Trump, the king of the black people. We got to vote him in. And when he, once we vote him in, that, that that's automatically we going to vote them out. When I say them, not T-H-E-M, D-E-M. Vote them out. Democrats. Democrats. Demon rats, whatever you want to call them, because that's what they are. They're a bunch of rats, a rats from the pits of hell. <sighs> now I'm in my little preacher voice over here, y'all. Y'all got me triggered. Make sure everybody share this video, please.
because I am doing what Trump did in 2016. I'm asking every African-American vote for my president, our president. I'm asking every African-American. I'm going to repeat what Trump said in 2016. What the hell you got to lose? Still, your school's no good. You, you have no jobs. Now you got a job now. Now, 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 now you, oh, wait, now you got jobs now. But what I'm saying, what the hell you got to lose? Look what the Democrats have done before 2016. Now what? We got a lot to gain. We vote for Trump. We got a lot to gain. We have a lot to gain. See, these people want to gain fame, but we're going to gain, woo, we, 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 we're going to gain uh, originality. We're going to gain our country back. We're going to gain jobs. We're going to gain respect. I'm telling you, we're going to gain um, smarter grandchildren, great grandchildren, more wisdom, with more knowledge, with more understanding, with more love, with more education, with more social development. With more unity. Hmm. May I keep on going? Because you'll know I'm spitting that fire to you. Shout to everybody this afternoon. Please share this, everybody. Please do. We need your vote, black people. Black voices for Trump. We need your vote. Well, black us black voices for Trump need y'all vote. We all need y'all vote. Matter of fact, y'all need y'all need y'all vote. I don't think you get what I'm saying. Y'all need our vote. Y'all need it. Y'all need y'all vote. Y'all need our vote. Y'all need y'all vote. We need y'all vote. You want to be free? Be free. But I don't give a damn what nobody safe. Uh, uh, Trump spoke the truth when he said against Biden. I've done more. I've done. I'm the best president. He's the best president since Abraham Lincoln. He's done more blacks. I'm the. I mean, d- d- done more for blacks, and that's the truth. Statistics shows it. They always want to blame. Oh, it was the last president. Shut the hell up with y'all. Same old propaganda with the same old popular uh, slurs, popular uh, you know slogans, and the popular opinion. Once again, y'all are popular minions. Hm, y'all don't know what you're talking about. Y'all don't know what y'all talking about because you are a liar and a truth is not in you. And but if you want the truth in you, vote the right way. Vote the right way. Do it, man. Do it. Go vote the right way. Vote the right way. Okay, that's good. I mean, I mean, I mean, the truth always wins. The truth, my, like, like, like my, like, like, like my brother uh, John Amad always said, the truth breaks the chains. The truth breaks the chains. It it breaks it. The truth do not keep you there. The truth break that chain right there. You free. You could run from Massa. You could run from Massa Burn, Massa Bernie, Massa Biden. Masa uh, uh, Obama, you know, way black. Masa uh, Harris, all of them. You can get away from Masa. You can stop working for buttermilk biscuits and start doing it platinum style. You dig what I'm saying? Stop building your own stuff. You dig? And that's what you got to do. Build your own stuff. Gotta do that, y'all. You gotta do that. You gotta get out. You gotta get out. Because if you don't get out, this is this is where you die at. This is where you die at. This is where you fry at. You feel me? All right. With that being said, I'm out of here, y'all. Get the thumbs up. I appreciate everybody. I'll be having more content on here. And from the bottom of my heart, I love y'all. You know, 
And I love y'all enough to tell the truth. I love y'all enough to give y'all the proof. Okay? So, much love to y'all, man. Remember, keep America great. You dig?